We got the oyster patty. At the New Orleans Jazz and Heritage Festival, there's food and food. And if y'all haven't eaten a true Chandelier Po' Boy, get on that. And more food. But when the heat sets in on festival goers, besides getting a drink or the classic mango freeze, they may be looking for something new to cool themselves down. Like two of the new cold food items, shrimp ramelade po' boy or a Louisiana crawfish salad bowl. Oh, that's really great. And I had the daunting task of trying them both. Oh, you're going to feed it to me? Oh, absolutely. All right, I'm going for there it. There you go. Go in. Mm. Mm. Marty Schmidt from Smitty's Seafood Restaurant that's located at 2000 West Esplanade Avenue in Kenner says they already sold cold shucked oysters at their booth. So she figured festival goers may want more cool seafood. This is a good item to add, something cold. It's not a hot item. It's already hot outside. So that's why we did that. And some who are catching shade at the grandstand agree. Mm. Oh, yeah. Oh, that's, that's right on, man. So much better. Yeah, I mean, I'm always looking for cool stuff. The salad roll has crawfish, mayonnaise, celery, green onion, and a little bit of Tony Satcher is seasoning. Then we found a bakery in Kenner called Cortoza's. They made the bread for us, split it on top, nice and soft, and that's all we do. And the shrimp remoulade. Well, yeah. It's very good. Jeff Levy of TJ Gourmet Catering says one of the secrets to the cool dish is that the shrimp are boiled and crab boiled. So it's got nice little seasoning in it. And then we introduced the uh, homemade rumelot sauce with some green onions in it and everything. And of course, it's over a Leidenheimer pistolet with sesame seeds. So it is delicious. You can get the shrimp rumelot as a po' boy or as a salad without the bread and food area too. In both dishes, are now on some festival goers list for the days ahead. It already is. I'm coming back for it tomorrow, yes.